A proposed annexation in Vigo County creates a mixed reaction in the affected area. Good evening, I'm Patrice Dayton. And I'm Mark Allen. Some Vigo County residents and business owners are not happy with the thought of becoming Terre Haute City residents. They say the extra taxes will not outweigh the extra benefits. News 10's Dan Klein has more on this controversial proposal. Something. Don Trillick cut some tree limbs at the Vigo County home he's lived in for almost 40 years. A proposed annex by the Terre Haute City Council would make him a city resident. I don't see where a person gets anything, just that the cities, to me, it's just a big money grab. They grab it all and, and they don't give you anything back. He lives on a fixed income and doesn't want to pay higher city taxes. And he's not alone. Commercial property owners don't like the idea of paying taxes that could be 35% higher. I'll see no actual gain because there's no other services that the city can give me other than police protection and we have uh, Vigo County Sheriff's Department and Indiana State Police. The proposed annexation plan for now is in three parts seen here in the three different colored areas. If the entire section was annexed, $200 million of property value would move to be within city limits. Okay. County Commissioner now, Judy Anderson says financially it doesn't make that much you know, difference um, to the county. Fewer taxes are a trade-off for fewer services needed. We're going to lose revenue, but we're also not going to have to provide services to those people. But for Trillick, he likes his current level of service as well as his current level of taxes. It'd just be lose, lose, lose for us in this neighborhood. A loss for him? It's yet to be determined if it's in the city's gain. Reporting in Vigo County, Dan Klein, News 10. For a closer look at the map as well as an estimate of how much revenue the annex would bring the city, Go to our website, WTHITV.com. The Annexation Study Committee from the City Council will meet again June 1st at 4.30.